going hunt. We got what you want. We got gold and silver. Seems everyone's a winner. It's a will of entry. You need one free entry. Every single raffle. Make your collection dazzle. Hello everyone. Hello everyone. I'm having me. Suvers. For me poorly, poorly. Man flu, which is nearly gone. It's been a lot of work getting rid of it, but it's nearly gone. As you can imagine, I was nearly dead and dying. But we got there, we got through it. We manned up. We did. Bless your little cotton socks. Right, should we just crack on? Because this is going to be a long, long evening for everyone, yeah? Yeah. We'll do like we did before. You can talk and do as you normally do, you know. Um, just rub it on as always. And um, rub it on. And I'll just, you know, spin. I'll keep an eye on comments. I'll put in the words and the names and what they've won. And as well as getting the next will ready and keeping on top of that. But you carry on and just talk, all right? Yeah. Cool. So you carry on and do all that stuff. Those yes. Little, the bitsies and bobsies. Got to do something. Pretty and, much. Uh, and I'll just carry on. Hello, Andy, Eddie Beck, Stuart Skulls, Jeffrey Brinklow, Tracy Gardner. Um, just to yeah. let everybody know as well, sorry. Um, Stuart Scholes has put a question, when's monthly spins? Well, that is actually tomorrow. Tomorrow is the um, is tomorrow. the last day of the month, so we're going to be doing them at 3 p.m. tomorrow. Tomorrow. All right. Tracy's been missing the sound of my voice. She's happy. She's got hearing aids. As Facebook user, hello, Facebook user. Can't see your name, so stick your name in and uh, or at the end of each message, and then we know we're talking to you. I'm just going to crack on. We're going to do a competition as well. I'll let you yeah. crack on. All right? Mate, you've cracked on already. Chrissy Cross, hello. Uh, good evening, everyone. Hello, Katie. Jay Calvin wins the 100 Years of the Girl Guides BU 50p coin, 2019. Well done. Uh, it's Mark. Hello, mate. Nice to see you. Beatrix Potter 50p coin album goes to Tracy Gardner. Whoop, whoop. There you go, Tracy. Little win for you. 128 entries there were on that one. Henry Long wins the Gruffalo 2019. And that's a Alan Turing. Alan Turing package coin. Next up, if you want to join in tonight on the tickle tape look, Dwayne Hodges wins the Alan Turing. Henry Long won the Gruffalo. Whoops, today's this. Dwayne Hodges. Vince Allen Truly. Next up, Elizabeth the Second Penny Coin. That's a 1967. Kevin Rawdon. Well done, Kevin. This one had quite a lot of entries. This had 660 entries. It's the 2003 annual coin set proof deluxe edition. Ah, in the red box. That'll be one of those in the red box. Sometimes we're in a black box. Tracy Gardner. Whoop, whoops. Well done for you. Well done, well done. Team GB limited edition presentation pack. This had 153. Ken Rawdon again, well done. Next up is a set that I actually quite like. 
it's the around the world in 80 days bu set in a box uh, is it yeah it's just the brilliant uncirculated edition that's all it's still a very nice set oh look at that louise stole it from henry well done louise <coughs> and, uh, <coughs> Got the 2015. Tempt us to part with our banks tonight. Well, um, yeah, I did have something, but now I'm not too sure about that. And I have only, I had only, I wasn't going to do any, to be honest. And then I thought I'll do a couple. There's a couple of things that I can uh, put up. And then I was going to do something else, but now. Someone's put me off that idea. So, <laughs> so uh, no, not much. I need a. I think I need a week to uh, to get some good ideas for that somewhere along the lines. Because what we really need for that is we really need. It's not so much as expensive items. We need something a bit unusual. Is what we need for that, I think. I don't know what unusual could be, but. 2014 outbreak 20 pound fine silver coin won by Henry Long Eeyore 50p silver proof also won by Henry Long and he's going to do a hat trick Tigger silver proof no he hasn't I thought that was Henry Kieran right in the middle well done Kieran Twenty twenty one Christmas editions goes to Tracy Gardner. I tell you what, it seems to be the Tracy Tracy Gardner show, yes. At the, Tracy at this one. Kevin Henry show. That's what this is today. Right, next up. Oh, yeah, Kevin got the twenty twenty one Team G B limited edition presentation pack. Alan right. Turing. Silver proof. Christmas goes to... set there, one by Tracy Gardner. Alan Turing. Stuart Skulls, he bags one. Okay, now, the, we, unfortunately, we've got a gold thing, but we haven't got a silver one. But this one is a super duper now. This is the Dame Vera Lynn we're about to draw. This is the Dame Vera Lynn five ounce silver proof. This one has had 1,500 entries. It sold out uh, last night. The new one is up, which is a gold proof Mayflower. So we're going to do the draw for the five ounce silver proof so and i'll talk to you more about the other one in a minute when i've uh once you've sweet. gone through all your tablet and yeah yeah okay best of luck everyone silver proof goes to henry long called henry long. Yes. done well on the old um competitions today have a look who's on there. Right now we're at a later time i wonder if henry will join us because we haven't seen him for a little while have you henry henry no but i spoke to him the other day michael okay. Rock, katie michael right then right then well right right. Between stuart right in between kieran so unlucky there guys okay next up we have george's draw subscribers only so this is everybody who's taken out a subscription for george's draw first prize oh i better shuffle it first prize is a choice of silver coin offered plus 50 pound cash for cash or cyber cash plus 150 pound membership voucher or price competition credit that's a mouthful okay. and that goes to mr stewart nice well done second place which is a choice of silver coin from offered plus a hundred pound membership voucher or price competition credit goes to Alf Calvin. Well done. Well done. 
And finally, the third prize for the George's Draw subscribers only is a silver coin from offered plus £75 membership voucher or prize competition now, credit. In this draw, you need to be a subscriber of George's Draw. This is just for the subscribers. You can buy some entries in the George's Draw at the end of the stream, but if you want to be in the one at the beginning of the stream, take out a subscription. I don't know how much it is. I think it's 16 50 a month. Um, Stuart, when's full spread draw? I think it's ending within this week, in which case it will be done for next Thursday. That's when it will be done. All right, so whenever the, that, that one comes off, the new one for April will go on. So that will carry on, but then the draw, it's whenever the next Thursday is. All right. Okay, so let's crack on. 50p.tv. Uh, Kate is raising some money because it's her grand's funeral today. She had her grand's funeral today, and she's raising some money for the Alzheimer's Society. And uh, so she'll put a link in in a bit. Um, if anybody would like to donate or chip in a little bit with that, that would be uh, very much appreciated. P T V run by Kevin Rawdon, set of four vintage prints, which is on that particular occasion four prizes. Oh, where's my first of the multiplication was today? It's anjessup.co.uk, and this goes to Mr. Jeffrey Brinklow. Jeffrey, what number is he? Well done, Jeffrey. Uh, three. Three. So because he's a, he's, he gets to add three, so when it's a multiplier, he gets to add three on whatever it lands. So the prize one is a 1980 Britannia 50p. And he already starts off with three of those, and then we go on the multiplication. Need to print off the uh, double up choices again. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to do the big wins and the Brexit 20 um, without anything on the screen because I'm going to put the link up from Katie. So if you have a little look, um, that's all going to be on your screen for the next two spins. All right. So andjessup.co.uk, Jeffrey Rinko, three plus three is times six, times six for Jeffrey. Big wins now. I'll read them out to you what one we're on next. And you can click on it in the comments. Yes, you can click on it in the comments, but if you're watching on Facebook and you need some time to make a note of the URL, it would be greatly appreciated. Um, just jot it down and then go to it on your phone after the stream or during. It depends if we bore you enough. And then uh, maybe do it afterwards. All right. So bigwins.tv is Gary Fitzjohn. Well done. Well done, Mr. Gary. Right, so uh, the Vera Lynn one is done. Five ounces gone. And we have a new one up, which is the Mayflower. Two pound gold one. Now, this one's a little bit special. It's got the same 100 instant wins. However, if you're lucky enough to get number 13, because that's the best number in the world, then you get a full a to z silver set all of them all 26. i'll be honest with you um i think the chinese will argue that point of it being the best number in the world it's the best number in the world it is okay so to let everyone know we're on brexit20.co.uk which is modification world all right hello rob barnes so if you're lucky enough to get number three you don't have to get it live um you don't have to get it live at all. If you're lucky enough to get number 13, what we'll do is if you get it live, we'll give it, we'll throw in a bonus of a triple whammy and a and a, a live spin. Right? Okay. Sorry, just to interject, uh Jeffrey Brinklow just got a sheet of coins as his double up. So he starts off with times two plus he gets to add three. So this would be interesting. Three plus three oh. is six. 
times two is 12. So it's 12 sheet of coins, 12 prizes. Well done, Jeffrey. Sorry, as you were saying. Yeah, that's all right. So if you're lucky enough to get it whilst we're live, then you'll get a, a triple whammy spin and you'll get a live spin. That's the only extra bonus for getting it live. But it doesn't really matter when you get it because if you get number 13, you get the whole full silver set. Um, and if someone I've, I've budgeted in the number of tickets for sale, etc., and the amount of money I expect to take in, I've budgeted to swap that for another juicy prize. So if one of you happen to get number 13 a bit too early, I might, I'll be able to, I'll put another one up, another juicy prize up on a different number, you know. And, you know, just change one of the other numbers to a, a juicy prize. But I'm hoping, obviously, my gamble is that um, it goes and goes and goes. And, you, you know, it takes a couple of weeks before you get number 13. I'm hoping that we end up doing about 500 entries a week. That's what I'm hoping, because it's set for 12 weeks. And it doesn't matter whether we've sold the entries or not. The draw is going to happen on that day. So the counter is counting down. But obviously, if we sell all the entries quicker rather than later, um, then the draw will be quicker. So just a little recap. Gary Fitzgerald won 2017 Tale of Peter Rabbit. Jeffrey Brinklow got a 1980 Britannia times six. Then he got a sheet of coins times 12. Kate Gibson got a 1980 Britannia. 50p, Mark Hunter got a hockey 50p times two on a double up wheel. Hello, Chris. Nice to see you. Not missed a great deal. So, yeah, so that is a it's a really good one to go in for. And, of course, every entry that you uh, buy and you don't get an instant win is an entry to win, pardon me, the gold Mayflower. Oh, this is the first one which is dangerous for you for today. What is it? What is it? What is it? How many long? Four Monty Six member going on. Four Monty Six. And he gets. And you're lucky. It's oh, not his double. It's not his double up, so you're lucky. No. But he starts off with six. Starts off with six, he does. Six plus. Um, yeah, so also. Uh, I'll chirp on a bit more. So you remember the black box, Peter Rabbit, 2018, um, silver, 50p in colour. That's the one with him munching the radish or the, or the carrot. Radish. Radish. So we have a few of those. Um, so more than one person can have one. And that's 14, one, four, 14 prizes, if anybody wants any of those. So that's one thing that I'll be offering tonight. Another thing I'll be offering tonight is um, the Three Wise Men Gibraltar 50p, 2022. Look at a bit of paper. 2022, Three Wise Men, uncirculated. Uh, it's got Queen Elizabeth on it, on it, Queen Elizabeth II. And that's two prizes, if you want one of those. It's an uncirculated one. So that's two prizes if anybody wants any of those. So put that there. I don't know if I'll write anybody's name down if they want it. How about swaps and silver choice or first draw George? So yes, please. Oh, yeah, of course, because you've got, uh, yes. Hello, Ian. Nice to see you, mate. I still haven't forgot about getting back to you. I just haven't been able to. And uh, Katie put that link in several times when, uh, if anybody comes in, and we'll just remind people that link is there. And do me a favour, if you can, Katie, can you copy and paste that link in the team chat so I can paste it and I'll try and put it into Facebook as well, whoever's watching from. All right. Oh yeah, cool. Yeah, let's put it. If in you the send team. it over, I'll see what I can uh, see if I can paste it to everybody, everybody else as well. All right, John White has won a forty-pound membership voucher on a multiplication one. It could get expensive. Potential of getting a four hundred pound. What's he won? Four hundred pound, yeah. 
forty pound membership voucher times Ooh, six. Times six, it costs two hundred and forty pound. Every book we've got six chicken dinners. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Won't be many of them left. Uh, for, uh, Ian, when can I choose my silver proof? Is that from? No. Oh yeah, from the other day. Um, I was going to say tomorrow, but I've got to do the monthly spins tomorrow, haven't I? So Monday or Tuesday would be perfect. If you could send me a message, either whichever of those day, two days suits you. Um, if you could send me a message, and then I'll send you back a choice of three, and then uh, and then I can deal with it straight away. So if that works for you, that'd be perfect for me. Eddie Beck gets 15 Ireland coins. And if anybody wants any of those um, swaps, let me know. So if you want the three wise men to brought a 50p, two prizes for that. Black box, silver Peter Rabbit, one, four, 14 prizes for that. So if you want that, let me know. Gary Waring, does he get to add any? Gary Waring adds, I think he's on the gold wheel, you know. Uh, I think Gary gets to add one. Okay. But if I've got that wrong, Gary will shout at me by message anyway, and uh, I'll change it. Gary okay, Waring. so one plus four is five times five. Gary, now we're on iangrand.co.uk. When we come to the uh, gold, the YouTube gold, if he's on there, then uh, I need to change that and add an extra one. Okay. I'll leave you to remember that then. Yeah, yeah that's fine. This is Paddington Tower 50p times two. Because it's a double up. EMP Lambert now. Chris Dyer there. Paddington at the Tower 50p times two. gets that one just checking to see if anybody's got uh, number 13 yet because a few of you have had a go already dad scott donaldson what does he get to have three three yeah oh. did you remember to um do no. the number I've forgotten. Oh. Uh, what? Get to do what numbers? The numbers on the Mayfair hour. What are you on about? Remember that the numbers only go up to a thousand or something. Well, have you or, looked? Si no, I haven't. No. Oh, well, that, <laughs> You're trying to well, make me look a plonker now, aren't you? Well, I'm just saying, like, why well, haven't you looked? up the path to make myself look a plonker, aren't you? Because you're going to go, have you checked, Dad? Make out like you haven't done it, and then say, have you checked? No, I haven't checked. No, you haven't checked. No, I haven't checked, which means you've done it. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> okay, just because I just saw some different, some high numbers, that was all. Okay. 
Yeah, well, if you know it, it's if, it, if you saw some higher numbers, chances are that I've done it. So if it's gone above the 1500, which is what it was previously, I believe. So if you see a number for 2000 something, then you know it's gone all the way up to seven. Yeah, see? Funny, that, isn't it? Up here for thinking, Batman. Yeah, well. Yeah. Scott Donison, 15 random coins. <laughs> Times 10. 10, I say 10. Just to let everybody know, I've just posted a, a link and a comment to all of our channels. So everything over at the Facebook pages, the Facebook groups, Twitter, YouTube, um, there's a link to the Alzheimer's Society for everyone right. to donate. All right. So if you can donate as little as, you know, I don't know a couple of quid. A or two, a uh, couple of quid. Whatever you can, then that would be great. Louise Walton takes this one and it's a multiplication well. Well done, Louise. DGBCO's Bunks coin on a multiplication. Just checking. My fridge has finally arrived today. Took a while. You got it. Happy with it? Oh, I'm buzzing. But the floor isn't. They've proper dug into the uh, liner. It's not exactly the best liner in the world, to be honest. Oh. No. No, ignore this, please. Ignore this wheel. This one doesn't count. It is the um, Kew Gardens again. It didn't change. So my apologies there, guys. It's a dud wheel. So let me re-spin re it. We've got one TGBCH bunch coin times six. Okay, so now it's... I've not had a chance to do a spreadsheet yet. Oh, yeah, because you do a spreadsheet, don't you, for, the, for each one that we do. Hello, Mark's British Coins. So... On the site, Mayflower Gold, and the instant win number you want above all others is number 13. Because if you get instant win number 13, you'll get a full 26 coin silver A to Z set. Whole set, all 26 coins. That's that's easily worth about 400 quid, isn't it? Four, 500 quid. Yep. And the rest, it's only going to go up in value. All of those will go up in value. You give it five, once you get five years under your belt, six years under your belt, then they start going. Well, I've started mine by uh, that H you gave me last week. Oh, yeah, I still ain't sent that to you. Well, now I need two R's, an A, and an IE. Exactly. What does Ian Menon need to... Um, three. Three. Three plus three is six times six. Six zodiac coins. For Ian Menon. Okay, now we're on Ostimate.tv. Quite a lot of um, memberships people have signed up to recently. I've just copied all over the names of the wheel today. So if you haven't seen it, if you go to the wheel lists, you'll see if there's nothing on the right hand side, your name has been added already. And there was quite a lot to I had them, so I had them on the right hand side because I'm not allowed to have the left hand side. Okay, so I'll muck it up, apparently. Well, last week, you know the issue of the uh, dad couldn't hear me after everything, the speakers and everything, he put it on mute. One thing that you would have oh, thought... Blame me. Yeah, blame me for it. But it is. It's your computer. It's you. It's probably something you clicked on when you took over my computer. No, it isn't. I, I never took over the computer because I couldn't even access it last week. Dads are never to blame for stuff like that. Always to blame. Technology. Sheet of coins for Phil Sanderson. It's like oil and water when it comes to old people. Louise Walton, six bunts coins, and David joins two prizes. You're right, realise when when you was you're you're that old, you never used to have history lessons at school. They were just called current affairs. Yeah. Do you like that? Yeah, I do. You're so old you cut the ribbon on Stonehenge. Yeah. <laughs> It never gets old, that one, does it? Not like me. Yeah, that's the whole point of the joke. Tracy Gardner, set of five crowns times two. Just 
Stuart Skulls. This is also another dangerous one because he's a full Monty Six member on a multiplication roll. If it goes on a double up, then you'll be crying. Yeah, I will. <gasps> Uncirculated dollar bill times two. There is a, on the home page, no, it's not on the home page now because uh, we've listed some more coins. So we've got, um, the Alex Horn one is on its way to us and so are all the new TGBCH coins that have been listed and they are the uh, mostly to do with King Charles's coronation and also there's one there for the NHS because this year is 75 years or something like that. So, go over there and have a look for the new TGBCH coins, all limited edition. Some of them are 200, some of them 100. And then what was the other thing I was saying? My cat's got the zoomies. I'll sort your message out tomorrow, Tracy. What is Kevin Rawdon? Need to talk to you about that one. Kevin Rawdon is what? Uh, five. Does he? So he gets to swap for thirty-five membership voucher. Yes. Thirty-five membership voucher for Kevin. Dot TV, which is a double up. 20 prizes for it's not 20 prizes it's 10 prizes ah yes yes 10 prizes 20 20 notes in total got it well done katrina katrina has a little win I had a dinosaur. Tracy Gardner banking. Bank. Jeremy Fisher times two, two Jeremy Fishers. Eddie Beck still lives with a caveman. Katie Gibson as a win. So I forgot what I was going to say, but I was going to say something profound and prophetic. Uh, but yes, yeah, so the nation coins, they're there. They're also on their way. So is the NHS one. So if you want to get them, it won't be a month. We're only talking about a week before they arrive. Um, so they're coming. And we've got the new Mayflower, the Mayflower gold coin up, two pound coin. And uh, and if you get instant win at number 13, you'll get a full silver A to Z set. Katie Gibson gets 20 Island coins times 10. So we won't be. Uh, I won't. I don't think I'll be doing any offers on the tickets with that, on the entries with that, because I would rather this time round. I'm going to try something different. We're really spanking super duper 
instant win prize and then if somebody gets that prize then put change one of the other instant win prizes to another super duper prize so that it keeps people's interest in going for the super duper prize of the instant win as well as winning the mayflower Valerie Clark gets an alphabet times three. Stuart Skulls got something there and I didn't see what it was. Monday's fine, Katie. Free, because you'll have some more tomorrow, won't you? Sherlock Holmes times nine altogether. Hello, Mark Dando. So if you fancy winning a silver A to Z set, all 26 letters in silver, the 10 Ps. Then you want number 13 on the instant win on the Mayflower. You can still get your entries for George's draw at the end of the stream. Not get your entries at the end of the stream. Get your entries now. George's draw is at the end of the stream. Derek Clark wins that one. 2006 VC Cross Award. 50p. You can get live spin triple before the end of the stream as well. So if you get your George's entries, anyone can get George's draw entries for the George's draw that is at the end of the stream. The George's draw is at the beginning of the stream. If you want to be in that one, then you need a subscription, and that puts you in both. Both the one at the beginning of the stream and the one at the end. So the one at the beginning of the stream is just for the subscribers, really, to keep them subscribing basically and the one at the end of the stream is a free-for-all so all the people that are subscribing to george's draw are in that plus the people that buy uh, an instant entry brian dawson does he get to add any no uh well that's a shame because that would have been humongous look time seven time seven not bad for brian We've also put the link again to the Alzheimer's donation, the little link. So have a look through the comments again and you'll see it. It'll mean a lot if anybody could just donate anything. I will be, at the moment, I'm doing like seven or eight jobs here while Dad's just sitting there rambling and even getting that wrong. So, you know, I'll Robert do it after. Barnes, and I'll say. That right, didn't I? Robert Barnes. Come in, Robert Barnes. Your time is up. I'm still poorly. No, let's not let's, let's not forget that. Daddy's still poorly. Oh bless. Olympic canoe in for Rob. Oh, guess what? <laughs> is now eligible for full fiber, so I could have insane speeds. And at a similar price as what I'm currently paying for um, just normal broadband. So I'll have full fiber, so it could be like a minimum of like seven times the uh, the speed. I didn't really get that. What, your your broadband has come down in price to a fiber? No, I've got full fiber. Fiber. Oh, fiber. Fiber. Yeah. Full fiber broadband available in the area which means it's insane speeds. Okay, you signed up to it. Have you not and it's going speed? to be the same similar price as to what we pay currently for normal broadband. Okay, so when you're getting it? I don't know, I need to sign up. Well, don't, I need, don't, I need to don't get, take... I need a technician to come down and um, give us a wire. So they might have to cut through the street. Well, don't take too long because obviously it'll increase productivity, won't it? If you'll be out work faster. Not really. You'll be able to get more done. Otherwise, what's the point? What's the point then? What's the point in going through all that palavers, digging up half the road, taking a couple of men's time up all day long to run the cables and everything, and you're not and you, and all that for a super duper whoop whoop speed, 
and you don't do any any extra work you do you don't you don't work any faster what's the point we get to watch some uh some decent stuff streaming you get to watch stuff streaming yeah what you mean you mean the television isn't fast enough for you you get to watch no. stuff on the television and you get like twenty thousand channels on there all of a sudden you need to have another streaming channel because no, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, no 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 never it's say get another mate, streaming channel. it just makes things a lot quicker and faster more stable look you no, need to get out, get out the era of using pigeon and making notes on a on a stone wall yeah. with with a chisel what you're you saying is a load of old toffee i can prove no, it, it. it don't make it any faster whatsoever yes it does no it doesn't i can prove it yes, it does the proof is in the eating of the pudding no yes do you know what you give me a headache so if a nice little win for Chrissy. this is dangerous triple whammy on a multiplier triple, triple just chrissy oh, gets to any <gasps> chrissy There's does Chrissy get to add any? No. Oh, that's a shame. That is a shame. It only if, landed on three. If you don't get any extra work done, then it ain't no faster. If, if it doesn't get your jobs done faster, if it can't make you do your internet work that you do for us, and it can't make any of that any faster because the pages don't load any faster, the mouse ain't no faster, the websites ain't no faster. The websites are faster. because they load quicker. So Everything's faster. Mean, exactly so if the websites load faster and the internet is faster and your mouse your little mousey is faster and the, and the mouse is faster, all of that is faster why, then why would the mouse be faster gets more done no it? because it doesn't make the mouse faster anyway why is it no stop a minute just stop why does it everything have to be about work with you it doesn't i'm just saying oh no, it sounds like it does <clears> anyway <throat> five just, prizes no, Five prizes. For Five prizes for Stuart Skulls. <laughs> yes. And this five? Is yeah, that's what I'm just trying doesn't to say. Bode well. This doesn't bode well. 14. Uh, like 14. Uh, what's four t times 14? Eight times 14. No. What do you want? Five times 14. Five 14s, 50, 70. Five times 14 is 70. Yeah. Poor oh, blimey, it's just got 70 prizes. Cool. Stroll on. Chrissy Cross. Hold on. Is that... Do my ears deceive me? Are you actually typing something? Are you actually doing a bit of work? Yeah. I'm always working, me. You can't see me. I work so fast. You, you can't see what you can't see what I'm doing. See, that's how I know. So I know these things. If the tools that you've got are faster, then you get more work done. If the pages load faster, then that means you're on that page faster. And all them fasters, faster, 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 faster. I think all you need to work your internet connection. Your internet connection is and at the end of the day, you should have done an extra half an hour's worth of work. You need to stop all this working because this, this is like... The extra, the extra um, what do you call it? Right, I've added that for Chrissy. Have you done Robert Barnes's bank? Good job, one of us is on the ball. Yes, canoeing. I've done that. Okay. Have you done, done Chrissy? Have, have you made a note? Triple whammy. Done. See, that's done. Oliver Lambert Shaw, well done. Does it mean you will be able to argue faster? See? Anyway, shouldn't be arguing too much anyway. Should be yes, Dad, no, Dad, three bags, full, Dad. That's where it should be. Whatever, Dad. 
or whatever, Dad. 28 pound membership voucher times three. How much is that? 84. No calculator today? Mm -hmm. No calculator today? No, I'm just busy trying to do the other jobs, mate, if I'm honest. Oh. Michael Bloxham. 496 on the Mark Barwell. Who's on the uh, the Great British Coin Hunt? Get out of the box. Not in the box. You are. It's there you go. Now you. I'm not doing nothing. Random alphabets. Random alphabets. I was going to do some alphabets, but then I decided not to because I just thought it, they're too expensive to do it this way, and I can't do them any less because I, I probably haven't because I've not got that many. To be fair, I have thought about searching ten p's. I, I have this feeling, if you like, that searching ten p's for somebody would be a really good idea because not many people do it. Like the same way that you do the 50 piece, you know, bag after bag after bag, boom, boom, boom. Because what would happen is sooner or later, you'd go to the bank, just like with 50 piece, you get a brand new bag. You go to the bank, you get a brand new bag and it'll all be letters. You know, they're still out there. So I've often thought about doing that because then you turn a bag, 100 pound bag into a couple of thousand, don't you? Just checking for I'm in for live and whammies today, please. Yes, you are. Donna Basha. So Michael got 11 alphabets. Donna Basha, 48 pound ECC. Sounds fine. Okay, I'll have a look at that. I have to keep explaining to the caveman, father, that the iPad touchscreen is a touch only, not press or whack. A difficult one for my dad. He, he used to <laughs> he used to belt it. Mind you, as I do sometimes, it don't work and I'm bashing it. Careful. Do you need to get a drop of water? No, I'm good, thanks. Paddington at St Paul's 50p for Brian Dawson times six. Well done, Brian. Have a look at that. Jubilee fifty P for Lisa. She's a four ninety five, I believe. Yeah. Yep. Five plus three is eight times eight. Okay, next up we're on the Zodiac 50p, which is zodiac50p.com. Jeffrey Brinklow. 50p that was, Jeffrey Brinklow. He gets to add times three, uh, add three, doesn't he? You get a bad fruit. What are you have for dinner tonight? I might be having a sausage sandwich. I had a sausage sandwich for months and months, if not a couple of years. 
Well, it's Fran not there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, but um, she bought lunch in today because she knew I was on the stream and, and she bought in a McDonald's, which I also haven't had for quite some time. Very nice. What did you have? Anything good? I had... It, they've got this... Uh, you know how every now and again they'll bring something out limited period i reckon it was one of those because it was because i've not seen it before it was a chicken sandwich but uh the most spicy or the um it had a spicy tang to the to the sauce yeah most spicy that's what it is and crispier you Ooh. got the crispy which is standard and then you've got the mid mc um spicy which is a spicy version of mccrispy and the mccrispy is basically a posh version of a chicken sandwich that they're going to keep all year round but the, the spicy version i don't believe oh i see okay that's what i had not that i know or anything you've had a few then well once i have had a few behave what are you trying to say well you've had more than me i've had one i, I can read you know that's the only one I've had. But anyway, yeah, so that's what I had. That and an apple pie and chips. So I don't can't have too much to eat because of my issues. So um What sausages are they? When her brother came down the other week, he bought some there's a butcher's in uh, in Lincolnshire that she she likes she likes their sausages. And he bought, they bought, his brother and his wife bought a load down, so we'll be having those. Lincolnshire sausages, of course. David Joy, three half crowns times five. Jeffrey Brinklow, a ham ball, 50p times six. Next week, I will have a few more items to tempt you with. But I needed to have a break on that this week. <clears throat> which is why I only had a couple of bits. Ad break. Shall we have an ad break, Harry, after this spin? What for? Well, because Andy Walton would like an ad break. Okay. He's yes. Young yes. Guy. You know, yeah. I need to go out and have a little... Okay, okay. But should we just do the 39 and 100 so then it's completely fresh for the members? So let's get this page done. About two more spins. Yeah. Okie dokie. Thank you. Hazel Andrews. 25 pound piece. Let's get these finished. And then, yeah, after we do the 100, double up, free for all. Hey, Phil. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Phil Sanson, he ain't got any double ups, has he? No. Right. Shoot coins. Okay, and now we're going to do the £100 double up, which is a £100 free for all. And then after which, we'll go for a break. Uh -oh. Okay, well. Sorry, give me uh, one, one, you know, it would take, take a little while to get into the swing of things, but a bit hammer I can't hear you, mate. your prizes. You're, you're um, going in and out of signal, mate. I can't hear you. Really? Yeah. Your, no. your video quality isn't that great. I don't think you've got great signal. Great connection. Okay. You're right. Have you gone and put your name and email address over on Ian's giveaway? There's the link there with Andy Walton. Don't forget, even though you did it last week, you got to in this week. Right, are we ready? you got to do that. Yes, sir. All right, I'll see you back in two. Oh, yes. You must be the Dutch guy.
in a minute, bud. Oh. <laughs> Almost done. Right, you're back then. I'm back. I'm here. Right, so. There's the link there for tonight's George's Draw. There's also a link for changechecker.com where you could uh, go and join changechecker.com. We... Uh, we're doing really well with the membership on that at the minute, and we'd like to get a few more. <clears throat> right, listen, Phil yeah. Sanderson left a comment. I think it's quite, um, you've you've duped someone out of their uh, points again. So I'm gonna crack on with the YouTube now. Oh, I'll check that right now, Phil, because <laughs> I know how to do that. Yep, he'll check it right now because he's not doing anything else, Phil. So you're all right, mate. He'll get on that straight away. Mm. <clears throat> that is a, a a mistake that I've made more than once as it happens, Phil. I sometimes forget to do the zero zero. He has pointed that out to me a few times. <clears throat> and it was, of course, Phil that won the live giveaway last week. And if you want to have a go at that this week, hundred pounds prize competition credit for tgbshraffle.com. All you've got to do is go to that link that Andy gave you and put your name and email address in. Customer switch. Oh yeah, I forgot we're doing that live draw tonight, haven't we? Um, as well tonight <clears throat> eric is 45 five plus four is nine twenty nine Yeah, I can see the mistake that I've made, Phil. <clears throat> Doing it now, mate. Sorry about that. I wouldn't have it, Phil. I'd, I'd write in complaints. Send an email to complaints at tgbch.co.uk and uh, we'll, we'll take that matter firmly up the uh, up, up 
up through the ranks on that. It's it's atrocious, to be honest, mate. Um, Mark Bennett, how many does he get to add? Mark gets to add two. <clears throat> so seven, five plus two is seven. That's been done, Phil. Yeah, Phil, I wouldn't have it, mate. I'd definitely put in a complaint. Atrocious service, that's what I'm saying. Overworked, that's the trouble. I'm just overworked. Oh, overworked. You're yeah. having a nice break tonight, though, aren't you? I'm overworked, underpaid, undervalued, underappreciated. What? Hold on. What, what about me? Our ego <laughs> team is 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 a bonus for everyone for a little yeah, team. Everything has to and be yet, about me. Oh, but me. it don't obviously apply to my real me. Okay, so what do I get? It's a trouble with kids, isn't it? Everything's got to be about them. Well. Well. I'm clearly not valued. You've got to look after your, your elderly. You've got to look after your mates and mates. And he's looking after. Be respectful. I mean, back in my day, I'd have washed my dad's car, things like that. You know, gone round and dug his garden for him. You, but, but where are you? You're never here. Never coming round with a shovel, are you, really? Well, yeah, why is that? I never get that. Really. Yeah, not appreciate I bet, I bet people like Ian Menham, I bet his grandchildren come out and, and help him in the garden and See, look, things like you, that. You, you immediately think, right, it's when I tell you about the internet, not about how I can game with all these people from around the world, not that I can actually watch all these different streams in like 4K absolute vision. If it's any more clear, it'll be set on the TV, set on the sofa watching it themselves no your immediate thing is okay what work can you do for me mark dando how many does he get to add i sorry i nodded off then what was you saying mark dando three <laughs> Okay, I'll remember this. <laughs> That's you, you, you think it's funny? You want to give it the big one? Okay. <laughs> I'll remember this. Hello, okay. RJ. Just in time, mate. I'm getting terribly abused, I am. You are. I'm, I'm going to quit. Live. Bedford brain you if you quit. What was all this hashtag justice for Harry and all this? I need backup here, guys. Yeah, yeah where's your backup now, eh? Hey? Let's have a look. Uh, Mark Dando. Scott Donaldson, hey. how many did he get to add? Who? Scott Donaldson. Scott Donaldson. Three. Three, three plus five is eight, Tom's eight. Excuse me. <clears throat> okay, now we're on petrol. on the car and had to nurse it to the garage and then walk a couple of miles home. Blimey, that was lucky, wasn't it? Imagine your brakes failing at 70, 80 mile an hour. Had that happen once, bloke behind me in a full galaxy. His brakes didn't work, doing 80 mile an hour, 70 mile an hour down the uh, fast lane in a motorway. Hit me right up the back, he did. I support 100% Harry, look, there's Chris, look, there, see? Thanks, mate, you know, because, I mean, Harry, I'll get no love from my own dad. So I'll take the love wherever I can get it. Did you get your donut, Harry? I did, but not from Dad. Funny enough, um, Beth's brother had a birthday. I can't remember what his birthday was, but he bought treats and he went to, um, uh, what was it? Uh, oh, what's the bakery called, Beth? The Beth? Bakers? Butterwicks. Tom's Is Bakers. It? No, it's called Butterwicks. They've, they've started to expand all around Northamptonshire. And they do brilliant. They've got the Homer donut. And what the Homer is, 
is it's a pink donut with sprinkles on top and it's beautiful so i had one of them but so not from you dad but from beth's brother as a little treat for me because it was his birthday see a little treat they're huge they're like the size of a dinner plate oh that's the extra big one if you if you wanted to get the big one which i said that would be nice but i don't see an order form or just tell it you know butterwick's delivery is on its way to you from me and them but i don't see any of that no you see no. any of that not nothing not even no nothing mark then though how many does he get to add who mark mark dando three <clears throat> so no, I didn't get my donut, and I definitely didn't get a bacon roll either. Well, who was supposed to get you a bacon roll then? You. You said bacon roll and a donut. Who said a bacon roll and a donut? Oh, tell me going back on it now. See, I'm not getting any. You're not. No, like... You're not well. I reckon. I reckon you've been. I reckon you've been growing a few mushrooms in your garden or something. That's what I reckon. I wish I had. See, the conversations you seem to be having, they're with a different someone else. Bank again. How many does uh, Ian get to add? Three. So get yourselves ready for the new King Charles coronation coin. And uh, get yourself the set off of tgbsh.co.uk. How many is there in the set? Six. What's that? In the king set, the coronation set. I don't know, Dad. Have you looked? Do you know what coins there are, actually? Come on. Let's try and explain to the good people know, watching what, what they are. Come on. Let's describe. So, come on. First one. So I've got to find it first. No, no, no. Your coins, you should know what they are. Come on, <laughs> Father. What coins are I'm they? Looking. I'm looking for it. I am. I'm looking. Don't see look. What I have to put up with? You see what I have to put up with? Right. Let me tell everyone. Okay. So first yeah. up, we've got the official Royal Coat of Arms. Okay, so that's the official royal coat of arms for uh, royal family. Then we've got the King Charles cipher. Then we've got the Queen Consort cipher. Um, and then we've also got the King Charles uh, Long Live the King coat of arms. And then we've also got a series of three official coronation logo coins. So they come in different variations. So you've got the blue, you've got the red and pink, and then you've got the blue and red. So, yeah, that's all of them. I'm just saying, if you was doing your job properly, you'd have the pictures up there, wouldn't you? And as you mentioned each one, you'd swap my face for a picture of the, the, the I'm sorry. Picture. I'm sorry. You won't you won't see yourself a minute because um, you've just got cancelled and there's no, you can't speak right now. So I'm just letting you know you got cancelled so you can't actually speak. No what you can talk, but no one's listening. All right. Six plus four is ten times ten for Henry. He hasn't. No. Bugger. I thought you was only joking, but you did. You muted me. Yeah, I know. That's what I just said. I'm not going to lie to you, am I? I said I wasn't moaning. I wasn't complaining. Oh. Or anything. Oh. I wasn't saying nothing. All I was saying oh. was, all I said was, all I was saying was, because you're the computer man, and everybody knows you're a computer man. Just saying, if you're doing your job properly, then each time you mention one of the coins, you flash it up on the screen. That's all I'm saying. That's what the professionals do. Properly. Right. Well, properly might not be, the, you know, probably, properly, the word properly might not be the right. Right. Word. Let's just put a pause on that. Membership yeah. voucher for Andy Babb. What does he swap for? He's a full man. He swaps for 45. 45? No, four okay. <clears throat> So, no extra there. But he is getting an extra six times. So, his full Monty Six membership gets him an extra 240 quid on top of the 160 that he wins. 
wins 160, gets an extra 240 as a part of me bonus. And he ends up with 400 squids. Good, isn't it? So we've got one NHS, we've got one Alex Hall, and I think we've got six King Charles. How many was it in the end? Seven. A set of seven. <clears throat> they're not really a set of seven. You you say sets when they're not sets. Oh, uh, coronation coins, isn't it? Is that is that is that a correct assumption? Is that a correct statement? There are seven coronation coins that's the first thing we have to establish yeah how many correct. coronation coins are there yeah seven seven so again young it I was is, having a conversation with somebody and they said to me how many coronation coins have you done for king charles and i went we've done seven and they said to me so you've done so there's seven in the set there. are you doing any more no i'm not doing any more okay so there's seven in the set there but it's not a set, is it? Because you're all bought separately. If they were set, then you'd sell them all together, wouldn't you? Yeah, imagine having that conversation, though, to the customer. Yeah, well, you don't, no, right. All you they're need to say is, coins. do you know what? You're giving my goat a shepherd. <laughs> just saying. I'm just... Just putting it out there. Anyway, Eddie Beck's got seven Gibraltar 50p's. Mark Dando's got six Animal 50p's. Scott Donison's got eight 2005 Gunpowder Plot, two pounds. Jeffrey Brinklow's got eight pre-1947 shillings. Mark Dando's got six Alphabets. Ian Menham's got six gold, gold-plated coins. Oh. Henry Long's got 10 gymnastics. Andy Babb's got 400 squids membership. Henry Long's got 11, four prizes times 11. Of course, he snuck that one in a bit, didn't he? That's 44 prizes. <sighs> Henry Long got badminton 50p times 11. <sighs> cool. Derek Clark's got rollmint.org times nine. Excruciating, man. Tomorrow is the, uh, <clears throat> tomorrow we're doing all the monthly spins. So all of the people that have a hold a joker or Patreon gold or full Monty, three, four, five, or six, their monthly spins, what they pay their subscription for, will be tomorrow at three o'clock. So if you're wondering what that's all about, and you're watching and you're thinking, well, what's all that about then? Watch tomorrow's stream, whether you watch it live or on catch up, is uh, neither in or there. But watch tomorrow's stream, and then you will see uh, what people get for their monthly, monthly subscription. And then everything, as I say, everything that you get throughout the month should be a bonus on top of that. <clears throat> Lisa Thorpe, nine Paddington at the station, 50 P's, and Christopher Edwards. What did you just get? Uncirculated dollar bill times. Five. Now we come to the raffle subscription. This is one where... If you go to tgbchraffle.com, take out a subscription, £10 a month, and then you get added to this wheel, as well as getting added to every raffle that we do. On the day of the raffle, I need to blow my nose again. And then just because you're on this wheel and, uh, and you win a triple whammy, which will be done at the end of the stream. <laughs>
<clears throat> have them, please. No, do it now. Yeah. Uh, triple one, triple one is here we go. <clears throat> okay, I've run four Monty's now. There's going to be two spins for each wheel. The first one. Andy's, Andy's put this comment. I've seen it a few times, but I don't think you've answered it. What are the bank prizes you will have on offer this week? Actually, oh. probably not a good idea for you to ask Andy because he's probably forgotten. What were the bank prizes you have on offer this week? Well, <coughs> it was... Um, so the uncirculated 50p... Oh, sorry. Ignore this, guys. Ignore this. Uh, Full Monty Will isn't prizes. Sorry, Katie. You've not won the Cycling 50p. That's my mistake. Three wise men, 50p, from Gibraltar, 2022, uncirculated. Right, uncirculated it is. It's nice and shiny. Two prizes for that. And a black box silver Peter Rabbit, 14 prizes. So that's uh, on offer. Because there was uh, a couple more of those that Harry found. So they, they, they're on offer. And that's all I put up this week, really. Oh, I've done it again. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Ian. You haven't won a prize. You've won. Oh, you've won a nice little bonus. Under a forty-five pound bonus for Ian Menham. Two hundred and forty-five. Okay. One job, Harry. You got one job. One job. One. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. There we go. Cancelled. All right. Does my head in sometimes. It really gives my go to Shepherd. Cheeky. One job. I'm spinning wheels. I'm typing names in. I'm keeping an eye out. One job. So what? I mess up a couple of times. Cheek of it. The end of the day, that's why pencils have rubbers on the end of them. People make mistakes. Wonder how long it's going to take him to realise that he is actually muted and no one can hear him. And he's just, I see him flapping his lips from time to time. Yeah, I just realised. <laughs> you absolute. Yeah. You was going to call me a Tommy Tanker, wouldn't you? Yeah, that and a bit more. <clears throat> oh, was you talking to yourself? Yeah, I was. Don't know how long for. Oh, didn't. I could have been talking to myself for 10 minutes then, I don't know. Hold on a minute. I've got to make sure my power's still in. Hold on. Really? Well, you don't do that. You don't, you don't do that sort of thing before you start work, plug everything in. Make sure it's all working properly. You don't get all right, then, Mr. Mute. Do you know what I mean? You start trying to listen to people and you make sure you don't put it in mute. You want to talk, don't you? Yeah. Right, I've lost my arm now. See? Mark Dando. Copy this. Mark Dando, number this two, there. or Monty Wheel two. Thirty-five pound bonus. Four Monty Wheel free. Jeffrey Brinklow.
Ooh, there's the fault. There's a link to uh, um, the fundraiser that uh, for the Alzheimer's Alzheimer's Society. If anybody would like to put a couple of bobs their way. Okay, next up we're on the referrals wheel. Two thousand and sixteen Britannia, two pound coin for Andy Walton. Not bad, not bad. How many of them? How many does he get to add? Is it two? Two. That's time six. Time six, well done, Andy. Chris Dyer. Two thousand and seven Act of the Union for Chris. Getting through what's the time? Twenty four minutes past eight. We've been going an hour and a half. Lovely little win for Chris Dyer. Times nine. Times nine. That's a good one. Nine. That's nearly uh, maximum. Not long left if you want to get a couple of George's draw entries for the end of the stream. Win yourself a choice of a silver coin. Yeah, you've got five minutes to enter. Five minutes to get yourself an entry. Steve Fraser get to add any? No. Oh yeah, we was going to use the super chat as well, weren't we? With the uh, where people can pay in the super chat. Because sometimes people don't, if it's, especially if they're watching the show on their phone, they don't necessarily want to leave to go off and do something on the site, so they would do it later. So if you uh, if you wanted to buy a live spin, for example, and you send, because everything's in 99p on the Super Chat, so if you sent 9.99 by Super Chat, then we could give you a live spin at the end. Or if you sent... 25 quid, we could give you a triple whammy spin. Or as close to 25 quid as what it lets you get. Might be 24.99 or something like that. 
And if I'd have remembered it, I'd have mentioned it earlier, and then Harry might have said it would be all right to get your George's draw entries at 199 each. <clears throat> but I forgot. But anybody watching YouTube, if they wanted a live spin, you could get one by sending nine, $9.99 via Super Chat, which is a comment in YouTube, and you pay, put on your phone. <clears throat> you just click the uh, money bit, and then you put in how much you want to send. A silver worldwide coin. Dun, dun, dun. Jeffrey Brinklow. It's to free, yeah? He does. Steve Fraser, £2.99 rugby times four. So Jeffrey's got three silver coins before he even starts. And another five, eight silver coins for Jeffrey. Pardon me. Well done, Jeffrey. If you search exclusive on tgbch.co.uk, there's exclusive deal number 17 I've put up, and half of that is sold. So I'm looking to sell the other half of that. You can have uh, half of the half, which is a quarter, or whatever, but it needs to be divisible by the half, because half of it's sold, so I need to uh, sell the other half. So if anybody would like that, get in touch. Just search exclusive on the tgbch.co.uk website you'll see what one it is you'll see how much it is what it's worth and then uh, send me a message or let me know oliver lambert sure another winner there another win for him tgbch bunch coin times three David Reynolds, not many more parcels will go out. Have you got any plan? Have you done any parcels off the prize list, H? Have you planning to do any? Because for my yes. age, I'm not going to get much out until Monday, Tuesday. Yes. I'm going to try. Oh, uh, draws tomorrow. I'm going to have to try and get some more out, uh, possibly this weekend or early next. Please keep, yeah, you would get that. You keep those anyway, Jeffrey. Give my best to Pauline as well. Okay, I next step. Go, on. go on. On the TGBCH newsletter bill now. David Reynolds, 50 years of pride, 50p times five. TGBCH newsletter wheel. And race speed. Two thousand and seventeen Beatrix Potter Taylor Peter Rabbit there for Wayne Times Three Times Three There's some good stuff going up on the raffle site as well. Have you put anything up on there lately? Have I? <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. There's yeah, quite a lot gone up, some of which has been drawn today. So keep an eye out for anything ending. You need to get over to TGBTH <laughs> and check out it's ending soon. And if you want to keep updated as what's well ending soon, make sure to follow. TGBCH prizes on Facebook. Yes, because the ending soon's go up there as well. Stuart's goals. Mm. 
RM package times five. He'd be opening the shop soon. I saw a house for sale in Portland, uh, up where I live down here in Dorset, and uh, it is an old type house, a bit like mine, maybe older than mine. It's more Victorian, I think, Georgian and Victorian. Anyway, it's a six bedroom house and it's been converted into half a dozen flats or flatlet. And they're all, um, they're all, uh, got people in they're all rented i worked it out there's about two and a half grand a month coming in from the rent for the people that are in there and it's up for four hundred and fifty thousand. and i phoned up to the uh a mortgage place just to ask I, I was just interested not that i could afford it but i was interested you know how much would you have to put down as a deposit in order to buy that as a buy to let property with tenants already in it and uh, apparently, you'd have to put down about 50%. 50%. It's like £200,000. Hello, mate. How are you, Caspers? Wait. Don't just give me a bum. Come around here. Yeah. Yeah. He's a good boy. He wants his T R E A T. Good boy. That's what he wants. It's his time now, see? It's half past eight. And at half past eight, half eight to nine o'clock, he has his T R E A T. Eddie says hello, Casper. Join your treat, Casper. Join your Don't treat. Do that. Don't Join your treat, Casper. Don't be wicked. Go on, Casper. Go on. Where's your treat? Don't. He'll come in. David joins. What is he? Times what? And then he'll get all excited. Brexit 50p times three. Yeah, but what is David? Does he get to add any? No. Just empty your piggy bank then, Ian. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, I'll just... Uh, I'll go and smash that piggy bank I've got to get £225,000 out of it. You'd need a hell of a piggy bank, wouldn't you? No, the number of people watching. People I got twenty one here. Yeah? yeah, me and all. And one on Facebook, twenty two. No, that's twenty one total because it counts to Facebook too. Oh. Okay. I'm not reading Stuart's comment, just in case. Alexa, where's your treats? Alexa. Oh no, switched off like the wires come out of it. Where's oh, you, you lucky uh, 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 uh. Hold on, the wires come out. Oh, it happens with you, doesn't it? You thought you was going to wind me up then, shouting Alexa and getting my Alexa to come on. <laughs> I can wind you up. It's I so was easy. ahead of you, mate. I saw you coming. Stuart Skulls. Andy Walton's went off then, see? You're winding up everybody else. You're not winding me up. Mm-hmm. They'll want to stick you in the stocks and throw rotten fruit and veg at you. Alexa, play Afro Man. <laughs> <laughs> Membership voucher, £25, which he swaps for 40 Let's see if it started playing the song for everybody. It's only half the mattress in the spare room. 
yeah, I'm not getting that, Eddie. <laughs> Regarding the money, he's talking about money, the mattress. Oh, too. right, right, yeah, the piggy bank. Well, we're going to do George's draw now, I believe. Draw, okay. Has anybody got number nobody's got number 13 yet have they don't get it too early now someone who's had another go no they haven't got it every time somebody gets an entry <clears throat> you're one closer to to winning the winning the silver set <clears throat> Harry knows about the hiding places for money, apparently. So if you're hiding money, I used, put, I used to put banknotes in um, DVD cases. Don't do it anymore, though, because I ain't got any banknotes. So do you think so, because if 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 you if you let one go. And then remember that you put money in it. End up in a charity shop or in someone's pocket. Well, if it ends up in someone's pocket, they needed it more than I, didn't they? This is true. Any time before Christmas will be fine. But I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, oh, sorry. So do you want to get the the other one ready or anything? No? Okay, no. All right. Subject then. Right. First prize, choice of silver That's coin from Offord. That's £50 mm -hmm. cyber cash. More cyber cash or Casper cash. I've lost it. I ain't got a clue anymore. Anyway. Jeffrey Brinklow. Jeffrey Brinklow. Well done, mate. Wake up. Wake up. Sorry. I'm doing Get a grip. different things here. Do one thing at a time. Just get a grip. Pull yourself together. Lisa Thorpe. Very good. And then third place. Page two. Matt Clark. Well done, Matt. Matt Clark. Lisa Thorpe. Jeffrey Brinklows. Well done. Jeffrey's opening a silver shop today. Right, here we go. Five spins now. First up, Ian Redgrave. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Liam Redgrave. Silver plated coin. Straight in. No messing about. Mick Lock. Should be six one three quite right uh yeah i'll do that insert one row above one two three four five you've done it already one two three four five get out of the way no i can't i can't add the row what, can you, what are you doing you have another kit and add another kieran in it should be six not five as Andy just pointed out. Thank you, Andy. Stuart Skull's got a tennis. Mick Lock, Battle of Hastings, 2016. Or he can add it to his prize bank if he wants to. Spin number two for Stuart is a sheet of coins, which is his double up. Is it his double up? Because the is thing is, double up? indeed, is it is double up? Yes, it is. Times two. Does anybody want a silver, silver Peter Rabbit 
for 14 prizes. It's in colour. Is it in a prospect box? In a display box? In a display box. In a display box? No, it's not a display box, is it? The acrylic? Yeah, it's not got an acrylic with it in the black box. Okay, black box, sir. It's the black, it's the black box one. I was meaning. I've got that when you said black box. Well, I was a crib then. Got a chance. What? Have you found some of those? Should I just sit here and flap my lips? Have you found some of those acrylic ones? Yes. I've got a load here. Okay. Well, in which case then, if somebody wants an acrylic one for 14 prizes, they can have an acrylic one, which has got the plastic display thing in it. There we go. Stuart Scholes gets a vintage print, a DNA two pound, a Flopsy Bunny 50p, three half a crowns. Kieran gets a TGBCH coin. Wells, Wells, Wells. Roman shop membership, that's 150 quid's worth. Not bad for a spin. Remember, you can get a spin by going over to our website or Chuck in nine ninety nine on a super chat. <clears throat> Next prize he gets TGB Search Bunce coin again. Oh, this one's the Bunce coin. He got the normal TGB Search coin before. Yep. Oh yeah. And the next spin. prizes three prizes to go into his bank three half a crowns something I actually remember spending I didn't have many of them though of the youngster but you I also remember. used to barter in livestock I did have a fish when I was six. No, no, Three you sold it and then you made money, then you bought yourself another fish. We've all yeah. heard the story. All heard the story. Henry Long. Fifteen random coins. Danielle Rafeby. I've only got an hour's telly and then I've got to go to bed. 30 random coins. If you had a faster internet connection, you could watch it faster, couldn't you? Yeah. Well, I did. I downloaded the one you told me to get and now it don't bloody work. Another thing you told me to get that don't work. All these Hold on a minute. What are you talking about? Are you talking about the... Uh, they don't work. Are you talking about the three broadband, the 5G broadband? Yeah. Yeah, well, I told you uh, that it's, it's not even up you to send it back, and you was perfectly within your rights to send it back, and you never even bothered. So don't come at me, or I, I, you had ample opportunity to, to argue it and it to send it back. Even, it didn't work. It don't even come up in the settings now. It don't even come up in the Wi-Fi. Have you spoke no. to them? No. No, of course you haven't, because you never do. I've been, I've been too busy. Oh, you've been too busy. You found yeah, out you were out of contract with Sky. You were paying stupid amounts of money, you div. Yeah, I've been too busy doing all these jobs you don't do. Oh, really? You know what? <laughs> I quit. No, no, you I, don't. I do. You don't? I do. You don't. £61 
Close competition credit for Chrissy Cross. Florence Nightingale, £2 for Chrissy Cross. And a £29 membership voucher for Chrissy Cross. That's the live spins. Triple whammies now. Liam Redgrave, £91. Mick Locke. Mick Locke gets £129. Stuart Skulls. I do this tomorrow. A hundred and twenty-five pounds for Stuart. What do you mean you do it tomorrow? People might want to be entering last-minute competitions. Well, there ain't any finishing in the morning, is there? Well, there might be. Have a look. Have you looked? Well, there shouldn't be. Have you yeah. looked? I shouldn't need to. As it happens, you shouldn't need to. As, they, as they one there, try and get me on that one. Have you looked? I shouldn't need to look. As it happens, on that you one. You should, because they're all they're all random times, Dad. You should look. Because I bet you don't even know what's what's coming up this week, do you? As Andy just said, he just messaged me, and as Andy just said, if Harry was doing his job properly, he'd make sure that there weren't any en en any raffles ending on a Friday morning, because no, of giving me, you know, a day to at least give everybody their PCCs. No, and Andy, and also, said Andy that. also said, no, he didn't. Yeah, he did. Look, and and he also said, I'll show it to you if you want. Yeah, see, and he also said you got to give Kieran another triple whammy because it's the same on there, isn't it? You buy five, you get six. Oh, so who prepped the triple whammies? <clears throat> Me. Oh, I you, missed you did. Yeah, I missed that off, but I can't edit it because I'm not allowed, am I? I know because you're going to mess it up. I'm not allowed to touch the inner workings. You are allowed to touch it. I mean, I've done bad for 59 years. All of a sudden, I'm not allowed to touch it because I can't be trusted. Excuse me. No, you can be trusted. But you do click on saying, you go, oh, what have I done? And then I have to go in and rep repair it. Well, yes. Right. So I've made it easy so you can see and access everything, but you just can't mess it up. Yes. By the way, shame about old Paul O'Grady, wasn't it, Lily Savage? Mm. Did you like Lily Savage? You didn't really grow up with Lily Savage, did you? Blankety blank. Oh yeah, of course he had. Um, he was host of that show for a while. <clears throat> I remember my the one I remember the most is Terry Wogan and Les Dawson for Blankety Blank. And he knew it was that other bloke that had it. Les Dennis, he did it for a while as well, I think. <coughs> poor me, poor me. I need stuff rubbing on my chest. Doing it. Well, a bit difficult for you to do it, isn't it? And it's a bit inappropriate, I think. Richard Brabin. So, what else we got here? Oh, look at that. Kieran's got £80, 96, 88, 81, 85, and 160. Richard's hit a 79. Oh, wasn't I lucky there? 75 quid for Richard. Not even looking, sorry. Look at that, nearly 650 there. If you was paying attention, you'd notice that. Mm. I'm just, just saying, I wasn't having a dig or anything. Just saying, if you was paying attention. You had to look to see what competitions are ending. No, because I'm busy doing this and working. Oh, oh, okay. What are you doing? Henry Long. I'm telling everybody what Henry Long's just got. Eighty-two pounds he's got, and a hundred pounds Henry Henry Long's got. <laughs> Hello, Lee. Nice to see you. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, what, 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 what is it? Ah, oh, what, 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 what is it? What is it? No, well, if you're looking, then you'd know, wouldn't you? Nine hundred seventy-five pounds. Oh dear. 
four old me. If you were looking, then you'd know, wouldn't you? Chrissy Cross said, I won triple whammies, not, not prize wheel. Why did you spin prize wheel for Chrissy Cross? She didn't win the prize wheel. She won the triple whammies. Why are you doing that? Because you put Chrissy Cross on the live spins. Ah, oh, so we're going to be doing that old chestnut, are we? Well, you did. I think we're going to blame Dad, that old chestnut, yeah? Well, who done it? So it's, it's Dad's fault. Tell everybody it's Dad's fault. It's Dad's fault. Yeah. Right, I'm just going to delete those wins for Chrissy Cross. Gone. And we've got Chris, we've got you on the bottom of the triple whammies now, Chrissy. <clears throat> Somebody wasn't paying attention. Sorry about that. Right, we're going on to Chrissy Cross now. You're a bit late tonight. Yep, we're a bit late. It's right, uh, Andy. Andy, don't need to copy it, mate. I'm just using the ones you've already pasted above, just to let you know. Hey, eh? Don't worry, I'm just a, that was a message for Andy. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, first one for Chrissy was 81. 81 pound for you, Chrissy. Second one. Nine seventy-five. Hello. <gasps> I thought you said nine hundred pound. Yeah, because I, I almost typed nine hundred seventy-five instead of ninety-seven. Oh, ninety-seven. What's the other one? What's the other one? Seventy-eight. Seventy-eight pound. Sorry about that, Chrissy. Got you right there in the end. That's that. And the very, very, very last one, which is the hundred pound PCC giveaway which is if you added your name and email address, you are in the draw. And it is absolutely even because people are only allowed to enter it once and you have to enter your name and your email address every week to be on that wheel for free and you can't buy a go on the wheel either i might have to have a lem sip you know a bit of honey something <clears throat> right are we ready there's 24 ready. entries 24 entries to win a hundred pound prize competition credit Okay, best of luck, everyone. Move your name out. Move the box out of the way. What box? Your box, the purple box, so I can type. Or are you going to type this one? Oh, I see. Uh, Where does it go? The name goes there. Oh, it doesn't matter. Just leave it there. That'll do. Best of luck, everyone. 24 uh, names. Uh, let's just have a little look. Spins now. Emily Sanderson wins it. Well done, Emily. Well done, Emily. <clears throat> Remember, have a look at uh, Ian's exclusive deal 17 and uh, let me know if you'd like to take a part of that. And that's about it. That's us done. That's all, folks, as Andy said. If you haven't got an account yet at tgbchprizes.com, go and get one. Same for changechecker.com. And don't forget to have a look at tgbch.co.uk for the new coins and the Mayflower gold. Okay, thanks to Harry. Big thanks to Harry. He does well. I give it, I ride him a lot. I give him a hard time, but he does well. Yeah, that sounds a bit false. <clears throat> It's not false. I'm serious. You do well. You do, I do ride you, but you do well. You do a phenomenal amount of work. Absolutely yeah. phenomenal amount of work. And I greatly appreciate it. Right. So thanks to everybody else. Thanks to the whole team. Thanks to Harry. Thanks to Beth for letting Harry do this in the evening. And a big kiss for Beth. And one for you too, Harry. Love your bundles. And I'll see everybody next week, next Thursday. Uh, tomorrow, we're doing monthly spins. Oh, yeah. See you tomorrow. Oh, we're doing the monthly spins. Hear me. Tomorrow.
Deary me. And if you want to get your, uh, if you want a live spin or a triple whammy spin, get it in overnight and we'll do it tomorrow. All right then. Thanks a lot. Thanks everyone. See you later. Like it. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>